Uh, welcome back friends. Uh, in this video we will be looking at few uh, composition of uh, transposons. Now in this case we are having transposons 3 transposons 1 of uh, 501 then TN21 and then gamma delta and all this. Now in this case what we can see some very basic point uh, we can actually see in this case in all these transposons so how to draw transposons and all this just look at these structures you can find it it must have the inverted repeat regions at both of the terminal because this is a short segment of DNA so this is the transposons in all these pictures we are not drawing the whole DNA segment we are drawing only the transposons right so these are the transposons this is the first thing now the second thing the transposons are made up with one uh, short segment of DNA which codes for transposes because this is the most important part the second most important part in transposons so it have this so in all these cases there is A region is the transposon and transposes encoding uh, gene and uh, the second thing uh, is this res region which is the recombination site recombination site is also important because right after the transposon this uh, from this region uh, this transposable element can be uh, recombined with uh, the donor DNA uh, the recep recipient DNA right so this is that's why this uh, recombination site is also important it is called recomb uh, res sites and uh, another uh, stretch of DNA segment which is R uh, that means it is the resolves or the repressor of uh, this uh, transcription so the repressor molecule is produced by, co by coding this R region now from here the repressor molecule is produced and it controls the transcription of this transposes gene so that's really really important because not always you need to produce transposon and transposition so you need to block this transposition in usual times because the, I, this transposition is placed in your normal chromosomal DNA inside the bacterial cell so bacteria uh, don't always want to produce these transposons and transposes and all these things so only when it needs these things then only it uh, turn on this transposes activity then on then only the transposon can begin its work now in this case that, that that's why in in the gen in general times this repressor molecules are being produced and it start and uh, incorporated onto the site a promoter site uh, for the transcription of this transposes element and that's how uh, the transpose the transcription of this A gene is blocked uh, in the normal time but when only the cell need this transposition it block or it deactivates the activity of repressor then only the transposes are transcribed and translated then only the transposes enzymes can act and transposition can go on so this is the process of having this and in all these cases you can see there are this um, ampicillin resistant meth, uh, this this uh, different resistant genes are there in all these cases right so these are uh, also different types of examples you can see in this case okay so that's how you if you need to draw uh, the transposes you can find it sometimes you can find more than one um, more than one uh, resistant genes in this case sometimes you can find small structural gene in this case too okay so all these things can happen in this this part okay